Hey guys, this is Sanskriti Mishra. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how I make my Instagram Kira Kira or sparkle or glitter filters. So this is how these filters look like that I made using Spark AR software. And the Kira Kira soft brown one has been like one of the most successful filters of mine. Many celebrities in India have used it and right now it has reached like millions like I guess 70, 80 million something views which is insane. This proves that people really love the Kira Kira or sparkle filters and it's quite easy to make them a big big shout out to the creator of this patch the kira kira patch it is so easy to make these filters using this patch so this is the creator of the kira kira patch that i'm going to use today to make the filter go check out their youtube channel because they are making amazing tutorials and i have learned so much from them i am linking their youtube in the description box below so yeah without further ado let's get into the video so this is how it's going to look like once we have completed the filter this is the work that we have to do so let's get started. Click on the blank project. Now just go ahead and add assets and add all of the assets that are given in the description box. This will include the sparkle, the face mesh mask, then the RT Kira patch the fast color load patch and the color load that you want to add that is the lightroom preset filter now go ahead and click on no compression for all of these files i'm renaming these files for simplicity Now add object and add the face mesh. First we are going to add the retouch material. So add a face mesh and click on new material. I'm renaming it to retouch. Shader type would be retouching. Next up, I'm adding another face mesh. This is necessary when we are combining the skin smoothening along with the color LUT. So I'm renaming this to LUT face mesh. Shader type would be flat. Now choose face mesh mask and Click the arrow next to the texture. Now we will add object and add a canvas. Make sure the canvas is above face tracker. Now we will add a rectangle in the canvas. Make sure to select the size as, as full height and full width. I forgot to do it so I'm doing it now and as usual we will create a material for this rectangle I have renamed it as LUT and the shader type will be flat now click the arrow next to texture and we have the LUT and LUT face mesh textures next up I'm adding another rectangle to the canvas select fill height and fill width Click the material, create new material and I'm renaming it to sparkle because this will be our sparkle rectangle. Like 
the shader type will be flat and make sure to select the blend mode as a screen next we will drag and drop the fast color load patch twice because we are combining it with the skin smoothening and we will drag and drop our color load png file also click on camera and texture extraction and then drag, drag the camera texture now i'm connecting the color LUT to the LUT of fast color LUT patch and extract the texture of face tracker as well now we will connect the texture column of fast color LUT to our face tracker texture as well as the camera texture now where you have connected the face tracker texture connect it to the LUT face mesh and for the camera texture connect it to the LUT and here you go now we have applied the filter don't worry it will look like that because we have not yet connected our sparkle rectangle now we will go ahead and make the sparkles happen so just drag and drop the RT Kira patch we have to drag and drop it three times you can make it four as well but I'm just showing you how you do it with three RT Kira patches so drag and drop it thrice make sure you have a lot of space to work with now drag and drop the spark file also drag and drop the device And the third thing that we need here is our camera texture. So just drag it here. Now just right click and we will add value. We will add three values like this. now we need to right click and add 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 we will add three add now that it is done we will start connecting these so we will connect the spark to value and this value is connected to the sparkle of all the three RT Kira patches next up connect device to value and connect it to device resolution on all the three patches and the last camera texture connect it to value and connect the value to the camera texture on all the three RT Kira patches and now we will connect the first two to our first add and the last RT Kira patch to our second add and we will connect both of these ads to our third add that's it now just go to the sparkle rectangle that you have created and click on the texture arrow and connect it to the add this is it now the sparkles will start showing one small change that you need to make in the patches is add the pixel count edit the pixel count to 15 edge width to 5 I just make it 15 and 5 so this is just how I like to create it you can edit the numbers according to your choice and as you can see we can see the sparkles happening 
Just go to the face tracker texture and select the eyes and mouth column. So you don't see any glitch happening to your eyes or lips. So this is it. Now you can go ahead and send it to your Instagram app to see how it looks like. And then you can just upload the filter if you are satisfied with it. I hope you guys like this video and I hope you make amazing Kira Kira filters using this tutorial. Please do DM me your filters if you have made them using this tutorial and I would love to use them and give you guys shout out on my Instagram. This is my Instagram handle sanstriti underscore mishra. Please like this video if you liked it, subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon for more amazing upcoming videos. Till then take care, bye bye.